dollars a month. Just please don't leave. Four bizarre Japanese inventions. Capsule hotels became popular in Japan because they're ideal to stay for one or two nights. They're barely two meters long and one meter high and cost between $25 and $50 a night. They also include a television and Wi-Fi. They've also created a very strange silicone device that supposedly trains the muscles in your face and makes it slimmer. I think I need one. Apparently spreading butter is difficult for the Japanese. So they created a butter grater. It softens the butter a bit so you could spread it with ease. Now for $70, you could buy a pillow shaped as a woman's leg in a dress. And for a woman, they made a pillow of a man's chest with an arm so you could rest your head in. Five close calls caught on camera. A fan falls from the ceiling, luckily landing right in the middle of people sitting on the floor. <laughs> This car tries to pass a trailer and nearly runs into the oncoming traffic. A guy on a motorcycle nearly collides with a horse and a buggy crossing the road. This woman runs across the street and is nearly hit by a truck before slipping, falling and just barely missing the back of the truck's tire. Five rare phobias you've never heard of. Plutophobia is fear of money. People with this condition are afraid of handling, making, and being around money. Some people might even sabotage their own careers to avoid making money. Omphalophobia is fear of belly buttons. In an extreme case, one person with this phobia became physically sick from just the sight of a belly button. Decidophobia is exactly what it sounds like, a fear of making decisions. Dextrophobia is the fear of having objects on the right side of your body. This can also include the fear of being right handed. And lastly, there's phobophobia, which is, you guessed it, the fear of phobias. The answers to three questions about planes you've always wanted to ask. Why don't they have the same seatbelts as cars? For shoulder straps to work, it has to be attached to something sturdy like a car frame. And airplane walls aren't equipped for that. If they were, it would make the plane heavier, making it burn more fuel. Plane seatbelts have lift lever buckles, making it stronger, and so you can't accidentally open it. Why do planes have red and green lights on their wings? The red light is always on the left wing, and the green light is always on the right wing. This way, other pilots in traffic control can tell which way the plane is flying. The two different colors also make it less likely for the plane to be confused with something like a drone. Why are the windows round? round corners help distribute stress, reducing the chance of it breaking. Square windows are dangerous because the sharp angles are easy to crack because of air pressure. Five huge pop songs that were originally written for other artists. Pharrell originally wrote the song Happy for CeeLo Green, but studio executives wanted Pharrell to sing it himself, and it went on to become a mega hit. The Beyonce breakup song called Irreplaceable has distinct country vibes because it was originally meant for a country singer like Shania Twain or Faith Hill. Selena Gomez's first song called Come and Get It was a huge huge hit that started her music career, but the song was originally written for Rihanna who passed on it. And speaking of Rihanna, her hit song called Umbrella was written for Britney Spears in 2007, but both her and Mary J. Bleach passed on it. And finally, baby one more time is how the world was introduced to Britney Spears, but it was first offered to the girl group called TLC. This 17 year old goes to her friend's house for a sleepover, but then something terrible happens. In June 2008, when Cody was at his friend's house for a sleepover, his mom called him to check on him, but he didn't answer, so then she got worried. Cody ended up calling her back later, but by the sound of his voice, his mom could tell that something was wrong, so she called 911 immediately. At the hospital, they told him that he had suffered from a stroke. They then had to send him by a helicopter to a special medical institute in another state for treatment. Every single second that passed was crucial. When he got there, he had emergency surgery because he had a lot of swelling in his brain. They had to wait three weeks to see the results from the surgery to see if Cody would make it. They said it would take Cody a long time to speak again, but he was able to speak again just one month after surgery and his first words were, I love you mom and thanks to the surgeons for saving my life. He had to do rehab to learn how to do many things again, but after two years, he was fully recovered five animals that can kill themselves. Sometimes the horns of rams and goats grow so curved and big that they penetrate their skull causing their death. Horses and donkeys can suffer from abnormal growth in their hooves. If their hooves aren't trimmed, they can no longer walk because of the pain causing them to die from starvation. When turtles fall on their back, it's really hard for them to roll back over. When this happens, they usually die from too much sun, starvation, or attacks from another animal. During mating season, deers get into such aggressive fights with each other that their antlers get stuck together to the point where they can't be untied. When this happens and no one can separate them, the deer die because they 
they're unable to eat. Finally, the deer pig is famous for its two upper tusks. The growth becomes so uncontrollable that it pierces the upper part of their jaw. And in some cases, when they're really big, they could pierce their skull, causing their death. Five of the newest words added to the Oxford English Dictionary in 2023. First up is dap, which is defined as a casual greeting, typically involving slapping palms, bumping fist, or snapping fingers. The acronym CODA, meaning child of deaf adult, has been around since the 90s, but was recently popularized by the Oscar movie with the same name, and now is officially in the dictionary. Porch pirate refers to someone who steals a package that is left unattended outside of the recipient's house. Final girl is a character term in horror movies, referring to the female protagonist who defeats the villain and is the only one left alive. And finally, a super yacht is, well, exactly what it sounds like. An extravagantly luxurious boat reserved for the richest of the rich. Did you know bananas are going extinct? Currently, the most common and available type of banana on the market is Cavendish. But this wasn't always the case. Up until the 1960s, a different type of banana called the Gros Michel was in stores. But a fungus called Panama disease destroyed thousands of banana crops around the world, which eventually caused the Gros Michel banana to go extinct. It was then replaced with a more disease-resistant banana, which is the Cavendish. Now, 60 years later, the fungus is back and threatening to repeat history. Due to the lack of genetic diversity in Cavendish bananas, they're not as resistant to fungus like they once were. And the fungus has also evolved to be immune to most pesticides. One expert estimates that Panama disease could reduce banana production by 80 to 85% each year, which could eventually lead to extinction, or at very least, cost you a lot more at the grocery store. One day, a teacher named Nancy noticed a student wasn't acting like he normally did. So she decided to ask him if everything was okay. He started talking about his father and what he said broke his teacher's heart. His father named Daryl Peterson was very ill. Both of his kidneys were only working at 20% and he needed a transplant as soon as possible. The reason the boy was sad is because he never knew when it would be the last time he seen his father. His teacher felt terrible that this was happening to one of her students so she decided to phone his dad. She wanted to help the family and not just by doing something like offering to take care of his kid but she offered him one of her kidneys. It turned out that the two were compatible and they went through with the transplant. Now Nancy isn't just his teacher but also his hero. Five TV shows that got cancelled after one episode. NBC picked up the popular MySpace series called Quarter Life for six episodes. But when the first episode premiered and got terrible ratings, NBC moved the other five episodes to its sister channel called Bravo. The Osborne family's variety show called Osborne's Reloaded was cancelled by Fox after one episode because many of their affiliate stations refused to air it. ABC supposedly committed to the sitcom called Emily's Reasons Why Not without ever reading a script that cancelled the show after one episode due to bad reviews. The Animal Planet tried their shot at a stand-up comedy competition show called Comedians Unleashed, but the animal puns got old after one episode. And finally, Australia's naughtiest home videos was pulled from the air only halfway through the first episode because the head of the network was so offended by the show that he called the studio and told them to get that bleep off the air. Hi, I'm here to pick up my order of chicken and rice. For Luke? Yep. Here you go. Thank you. Really? That's amazing. Luke, what's my Amazon password? How would I know? Because you're young, you should know these things. Did you try my name? Yes. What about my birthday? Nope, didn't work. I don't know then, why don't you just change it? Can you do that? I don't know how. Okay, now you just need to log into your email and change the password. But I don't know my email's password. Athletes who were caught cheating. In 2012, it was confirmed that cyclist Lance Armstrong had used drugs throughout his career to enhance his performance. He received a lifetime ban and got his seven Tour de France victories taken away. Tom Brady demanded that the balls being used in a game between the Patriots and the Indianapolis Colts were to be slightly inflated to gain an advantage. Although they won 45 to seven, Brady was fined $4 million and banned for four games. Ben Johnson cheated to win the 100 meter dash in the 1988 Olympics. A prohibited anabolic steroid was detected in his samples for which he was banned for two years. Years. A few years later, he tested positive again and was banned for life. Finally, in the 1986 World Cup, in a game between Argentina and England, Diego Maradona scored a goal with his hand, and the referee counted it despite the evidence. 
Three things Disneyland doesn't want you to know. For a long time, there's been a rumor that some of the bones on the Pirates of the Caribbean ride are from real human skeletons. In 2014, a writer asked an employee about the rumor as he was getting off the ride, and she said the skeleton sitting above the bed in the treasure room contains a real human skull. Underneath Disneyland, there's a massive system of underground tunnels. One of the purposes for the tunnels is to keep the magic alive by hiding the characters when they're not supposed to be seen. Emergency vehicles also use the tunnels to get to their patient while trying to be unseen by the public so they don't kill the vibe. Disneyland strategically releases a vanilla scent through smellitizers which look like speakers. They do this because the scent is proven to calm people down and it also makes them hungry so they'll spend more money on food. At the main entrance, they use the smell of popcorn. The Haunted Mansion is made to smell musty and at the Pirates of the Caribbean, they release the scent of wet wood and sea salt. Five insanely lucky moments in sports. In the final seconds of this high school basketball game, a player throws up a wild full court shot and manages to make it to win the game. Next up, this baton handoff should have been a disaster, but because of a few lucky bounces, the runners were able to save it. During a college football game, this pass should have easily been intercepted, but luckily for Auburn, two players from the other team collided and the ball flew right into the arms of the receiver to complete the touchdown. After an incredible volley, it seems like Roger Federer is about to lose the point. Well, he's somehow able to make an incredible return between his legs. Okay, this one might not be lucky. This one might just be skill. And finally, Russell Westbrook is out of control as he dribbles towards the net. Not only does he draw a foul, he tosses up a Hail Mary that rolls off the backboard, hits the rim, then bounces in. How was school today, Luke? It was so boring. I just hate it. Breaking news. Turn up, turn up, turn up! Okay, jeez. Tonight, we're expecting 45 to 50 centimeters of snow, so avoid traveling if you can. 50 centimeters? I hope it's a snow day tomorrow. Dad, what are the chances that it'll be a snow day tomorrow? I don't know. You've asked me a hundred times today, it's getting really annoying, so just go to bed. Okay, jeez. I swear, if it's not a snow day tomorrow, I don't even know what will happen. Uh oh. It's the moment of truth. Come on, my heart's beating so fast. Please, please. Yes! <laughs> Are you guys ready to play Fortnite all day? <gasps> it's a snow day! Oh. Right. Good morning, class. How is everyone today? Good. Hey. Hi, Luke. Who is that? Cindy. Oh, yeah. Mom, she's just a friend. Just a friend, hey? Aha! Cindy Lachlan. Lachlan, 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 Lachlan! Hello? Yeah, hi, it's Luke's mom. Who? It's Luke Davidson's mom. Oh, hi. I was wondering if your daughter would like to go on a date with my son sometime. Uh, yeah, that sounds like a wonderful idea. <gasps> we were just at the mall the other day. I don't get why you made me come back again. Oh, hey again, Cindy. Hi, Luke. I set you guys up on a date. Why don't you go to bed early so when you wake up, you can open all your presents? <gasps> That's a good idea. I can't wait for 